The answer is yes, you can. But at the same time, no, you cannot. Let me break this down so it's a little bit more clear. Pretty much the debate is the Dexos D certification. We have two issues with it. One is in order to keep your manufacturer's warranty or your powertrain warranty, the manual says that it is recommended to run a Dexos D oil. It does not say required, but we're going to ignore that. The other issue that we have is that it's 0W20, and a lot of people hate the fact that it's 0W20. They think that it's too thin for that engine. However, the engine is designed with some really tight clearances to take that 0W20 engine oil. So the question that I want to answer is, do you have to run Dexos D engine oil in your vehicle in order to keep your manufacturer's powertrain warranty? I do have specific information because what I did was I went to gmdexos.com and when you go there, you're going to see, if you click on the Dexos D, you can see a whole list of different oils that have the Dexos D certification on there. Now, I know a lot of people love to run the AMS oil and that's basically where I'm gearing this question around because is that's the big oil. It doesn't have the Dexos D certification. However, it does say on there that it meets and exceeds, meets or exceeds. So let's get into my email that I sent them. I just clicked on the contact us button on the gmdexos.com website and I sent them this. Hello, I own a 2024 Chevrolet Silverado with a 3.0 Duramax diesel. I understand the engine calls for a 0W20 diesel oil and recommends Dexos D certification. I do all of my own maintenance and keep meticulous records. My question is that I would like to run an oil that is not on your Dexos D list, but the manufacturer claims it meets or exceeds that certification. How will this affect my powertrain warranty if I use a 0W20 oil that the manufacturer claims meets or exceeds, but does not have that official label on it? Here is the product I would like to run. And I linked the 0W20 engine oil for our 3.0 Duramax diesels. Any help would be greatly appreciated. Additional question, in regards to Dexos D, what does the Dexos D testing do that would make it superior to other diesel oils? I understand the gasoline Dexos is geared towards removing LSPI, but what is the difference with the diesels? And after a week, they got back to me, and here's what it says. Dear valued customer, GM does not comment on performance claims of products not licensed under the GM Dexos program. In the event you require an oil change, or a top off due to low engine oil level and are unable to acquire the appropriate GM Dexos approved product and engine oil meeting ACEA C3 C5 of the proper viscosity grade can be temporarily used in your 3.0 liter Duramax until a GM Dexos D licensed product can be obtained. GM Dexos licensed engine oils undergo additional testing beyond the typical market general engine oils ensuring your engine receives a high quality engine oil designed to maximize your engine performance for the life of your vehicle. General Motors appreciates your business and thanks you for being a loyal GM customer. What we have from there is that, yes, you can go ahead and pour it in there, but you better not leave it in there. So there we have it. We have some direct info from gmdexos.com in regards to the Dexos inquiry. And now, while it may have answered some questions, it also may have sparked up some new questions. And I don't know if I really answered if this will void your powertrain warranty. However, it is recommended that you just use Dexos approved oil, Dexos D approved oil. Since now the mobile one has a option available for our zero W20, it's readily available. A lot of guys are commenting that they've picked it up from multiple different websites, well as Walmart. So zero W20, Dexos D certification is really not that difficult like it was a couple years ago. However, you run what you want to run. And uh, I just wanted to share this information with you. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.